Hey YouTube, so this is basically a my beliefs video for you guys. Um, I'm hoping that I'm making it clear that these videos are hopefully going to help somebody who's new to Pagan or the craft. Um, kind of, uh, I don't want other people to be lost and I'm hoping to help you out kind of a thing. Um, now, the great thing about being pagan is that it is all so different for everybody. I mean, there is, except for maybe um, coven pagans, um, it's about your spiritual path and what feels right to you. So um, I guess this is my um, living pagan slash other half of out of the broom closet because I realized that I didn't touch on some very important um, things that should be considered when you are thinking about coming out of the broom closet and one of them is know why why you need to come out of the broom closet is it because you're tired of hiding or you're tired of your friends not really knowing you for you or if it's for the shock and awe factor and either way you don't need to look at it so much as you need to prepare yourself for an argument or a fight or for disapproval um, as I made very clear in my last video um, some of my friends were shockingly okay with it and I was amazed at that and thankful um, but there is something that you do need to make sure that you do you need to make sure that you understand what you believe in you can't just be because I'm pagan and that's why you you need to be able to tell them well I'm pagan and it's an earth religion I worship the, the triple goddess in her three forms and I also worship the green god in his forms and they're gonna have questions your good friends will have questions they'll want to understand you be prepared for that. Be prepared that you're going to need to answer those questions. And if you can't answer them to yourself, ask yourself these questions. Well, why? Why do you believe in the goddess? Because I'm drawn to the earth. Because I was drawn to the moon, to the sea. I feel so peaceful when the full moon's out or if I'm sitting by the ocean and the soothe calm waves soothe me I am I am drawn to the ocean and the moon I was naturally drawn to the triple goddess um, you need to be able to answer those kinds of questions you need to be able to say I'm a solitary Wiccan because when I am alone in nature it is right to me I, it feels right like I'm connecting on this this raw level it's just so hard to explain but it's there and it just feels right and that is what is important that you are able to actually know and to be able to answer the questions that you're going to be asked and that is important and I live pagan every day I wear my pentacle and I do not in any way shape or form hide it I do not go out shouting from the rooftops I'm pagan you know I I am me and as me I walk around when people approach and ask questions that's different depending on whether they're a total stranger off the street or a friend of mine or family member is how I answer their questions but I incorporate it into my everyday life and so yes I am openly pagan but I guess you just need to learn that balance that that line of where to know where you stand so that's my really quick little ditty not really quick obviously because it's over four minutes but um, just that's my advice to you just know before you come out just ask yourself the questions that you think could possibly come up or if you have another pagan friend ask have them ask you the questions so you can practice telling other people because that's where a lot of us falter and the ignorance takes back over and stereotyping us is because pagans don't think that they have to answer the questions so that's my advice to you and I hope it helps um, so know yourself blessed be